The second before a full leap was ground, the queen rushed into the church to count the lords and marquises, who seemed so righteous, but were in fact burdened with so many scandals and sins. Philippe tried to silence her. Instead, she stared at her husband and spoke of his shameful ambitions and schemes. At her command, she let in all the people outside the door. They all loved Juana's mother, and naturally they loved her. They became Juana's strongest supporters. Juana showed she wasn't crazy and kept her crown. Philippe, who had failed to take the throne, was stricken with an illness and tumors all over his body. Juana's father poisoned him. He planned to poison Philippe when he ascended to the throne so that he could take over. But his plan failed. Juana's father had to plot again. Juana heard of Philippe's illness and rushed there. Instead of being afraid of his terrible appearance, she kissed him. She chose to forgive her husband and stay by Philippe's side. She was willing to use all her strength to bring him back to life. But Philippe's condition worsened. On his deathbed, 